say I have a cross between uh, David Byrne of the Talking Heads and Michael Keaton the, uh, from uh, Saturday Night Live and all those funny movies. Very good. Men, be careful in your ads of using red flag words, which are physical attribute words. Be careful when you say you're looking for a woman who's beautiful, or a woman who has a great body, or those kind of things, or you're looking for the perfect woman. And be careful if you say something like, you prefer something. So say if you say that you prefer brunettes, even though you probably go out with redheads and blondes, but if you say you prefer brunettes, Every other blonde and redhead that would be out there might have all the attributes that you're looking for, but I swear they, they, they might not answer your ad because of that. Just keep away from those red flag words. Men have a tendency to use words that are more physical related, and women have a tendency to use words that are more monetarily related. Women will usually say, seeking a man who's financially stable. And some men can read that as being what? Oh God, there's another one who's a gold digger for gosh sakes. But not really. She could just say she just wants a man who has a good job and stable and a, and a good home life, okay? So ladies, watch out for that kind of stuff when you talk about financial aspects. All right. Anyone have any questions yet so far? Yeah, this is kind of interesting. So you kind of uh, got a little bit of information under your belt to go next, huh? All right. What we're going to do now is we are going to take your life and take you as a person and we're going to squeeze it into 40 words into an ad. Now there's this great little portion on here that says tips for writing the most effective personal ad. And it talks about, there's a few sections in here and I'm going to let you fill it out and it's a really fun thing. It asks you questions such as your vital statistics, if you were to compare yourself to somebody, who would it be, what is your best feature, what's your idea of romance, is your idea of romance just a, you know, just a nice dinner at a restaurant, are you really into the flowers and the wine and the candles, okay? Um, all kinds of things, so go ahead and fill that out. and. Thank you. 